a vehicle comes in exhibiting a power loss, one of the first things we'd like to do is a back pressure test on the catalytic converter in the exhaust system. We're going to take the front oxygen sensor out, put the back pressure gauge in, we're going to look for pressures no more than 1.25 psi, so if we can start up the engine we'll take a look and see what this is. As you can see, we have hardly any back pressure in this engine at all. The next thing we'd like to do is we want to raise the RPM of the engine to about 2500 RPMs and check it again. As you can see, the pressure hardly increased at all, even at 2500 RPMs. The maximum allowable at 2500 RPMs is about 2 and 3 quarters PSI, and you can see we fell far below this. This exhaust isn't plugged at all. However, if the exhaust was plugged and we did have a high reading, the next thing we should do is remove the rear oxygen sensor and install the back pressure gauge in the hole where the oxygen sensor came out and retest it again. There is a possible chance that the substrate from the catalytic converter got pushed back into the exhaust system itself and plugged inside the muffler. We need to check it in two locations to verify if it's a catalytic converter or the exhaust system.